I'm here in Mavaruma and uh, this is region 1 of uh, Guyana and we are here on the uh, cervical cancer prevention campaign. This river and the boats around here brings hundreds of people here every day and they have a small hospital. But the irony is that cervical cancer is at its peak over here. Even if it's very far from pool, at least you can see the doctor because we know the distance is quite far from Mamarumo, right? Yeah. So the purpose of coming here is to give aid to those who can't make it till now. There's a, a strong incidence of cervical cancer in this region. And we have especially been asked to come here, uh, Region 1 and Region 10, to take care of the people, okay? So we, what we are trying to tell you is to look after yourself, get a screen, tell your uh, people out there, and get advantage of this visit. So we are going home to home, uh, letting people know what we are doing here. This is a campaign against cervical cancer especially. So, Dr. Cox is with me. We are concerned about women's health. So we are doing a number of tests at the health center, right, for women, and we bought some medication, not much, but we come to screen women, check to see if everything is okay with them. Right? Because if everything is not okay, we want to attempt it early. And you can't get it because they live so far. Dr. Ghazi, then we have Dr. Zeng, and we come to check all the women in my daughter. Right? So when class is over and you go home, we want you to tell your mother, your sister, your grandmother to come down to the hospital. It was very thoughtful of you all to come and visit us. It is very good for the young ladies, especially teenagers. So we just check in all those above 16. We want them to come so we can check them because we're promoting women's health. In Cancer Institute in Georgetown, we get women from your area, from all other areas, in very advanced cancer, okay? Yeah. Then we can save them. So we come here, uh, your area and other areas, to save those women before they go to that advanced state. I want to tell them that we have to take care of ourselves. Come to the health center, to the doctor, the health worker to seek medical attention. I feel this is good because I get so much of children okay. and I want to see if anything is wrong to my womb inside. I feel it's important for every woman to have themselves checked regularly. We have seen cases where um, they have patients who are younger, even in the teens, um, with cervical cancer. So the thing is, once you, you are sexually active, right, you should come and have it done. Because prevention is always um, better than cure. Out of this grant, Diana had opted to look at two regions. We had region one where we went to Mabruma and we went to three areas within Mabruma. Today's presentation enriched my knowledge about um, cervical cancer. I think it has to do with you making up your mind. Because before I was pretty scared, but for some reason this morning after I heard it on the radio, it just happened. So I know died with cancer and mm -hmm. I had a friend who had cancer, she had radiation. So uh -huh. now I see she hair go back and she looking spushy back again. So I come check myself to see what's happening with me. It wasn't such a bad experience. I mean some people was something that you kind of were scared to do because they all 
start of it. And every woman should come and know their status. Just like how everybody wants to know if they're HIV positive or not, you should know if you have cancer because cancer is a chronic illness.